Guys, this is a really, really quick video to show you something really awesome. I'm going to make some condensed milk myself and I'm going to show you how to do that. It's super simple and it shouldn't take you more than a few minutes. Condensed milk only requires a few ingredients. It's mega fast, mega simple. We're starting with brown sugar, raw sugar, brown sugar, demerara sugar, coconut sugar, any of those will do. And some butter. I've got some unsalted butter here, literally pop that in. And some water and we're going to warm this up on Veroma. And then we're gonna add all of the other ingredients afterwards. So it's literally that simple. It's just going to warm up quickly. There's only one more thing to add and that's milk powder. Now for a really good condensed milk, you ideally wanna use whole milk powder. You can also use semi-skimmed milk powder. Try and stay away from the skimmed milk powder because it's just not gonna give you the same type of consistency. Just pop that right in and go for 30 seconds on speed 10. And we literally gonna blitz it through and then we've got our condensed milk done. This smells so good by the way, oh my God. It's done. Um, it's a little bit darker than you would normally find condensed milk just because I use raw sugar. You can obviously use golden caster sugar instead or just the normal caster sugar, but it doesn't give you the same insanely awesome consistency that you get with this. I mean, look at that. That's just perfect. That is just perfect. That is condensed milk at its finest. And if you want to make this at home, it's so simple. I mean, it took me, what, four minutes to make. It's less than five minutes, less than five ingredients, super simple, definitely more amazing than store-bought condensed milk. And all you do is now you just leave it to cool in a jar and then you store it in the fridge for up to two weeks or just use it up very, very quickly because it's so, so tasty. If you guys want to make this yumminess at home, make sure to follow this recipe and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos that are very, very delicious. This is actually the last time you guys are going to see me with my pregnant belly. The next time I'm filming, that's no longer there and there's going to be something here. So I hope you guys are as excited as I am. I'm really, really looking forward to it. And I'll see you next time, probably with the baby strapped to my chest while I'm baking for you guys. Thanks. Bye-bye.